हाउ टू फिक्स विंडोज अपडेट एरर जीरो एक्स एट डबल जीरो सेवन जीरो थ्री जीरो सिक्स हेलो फ्रेंड्स फॉलो द स्टेप्स टू फिक्स दिस एरर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल रन विंडोज अपडेट ट्रबल शूटर क्लिक ऑन स्टार्ट क्लिक ऑन सेटिंग्स गो टू सिस्टम क्लिक ऑन ट्रबल शूट सिलेक्ट अदर ट्रबल शूटर्स फॉर विंडोज अपडेट क्लिक ऑन रन क्लिक ऑन आई कैन डाउनलोड इंस्टॉल और अन इंस्टॉल एन अपडेट कैन वी रन द विंडोज अपडेट ऑटोमेटेड डायग्नोस्टिक येस द विंडोज अपडेट डायग्नोस्टिक फेल टू रन वुड यू लाइक टू टॉक एन एजेंट Microsoft has retired MS Dit troubleshooter and replaced them with Get Help app but in several circumstances this app doesn't run perfectly we are providing a link to the legacy windows update troubleshooter click on the link from the video description when you click the link in the video description a zip file will be downloaded click on show in folder right click on the downloaded zip file select extract all click on extract right click on this file select open click on advanced select run as administrator check windows update here and click on next this may take some time repair windows update database corruption click on apply this fix potential windows update database error detected fixed windows update components must be repaired fixed click on close and then go to start settings windows update and click on check for updates next modify services click on search type services click on services go to the windows update service this one right click on windows update select properties over here make sure that uh, automatic is selected on your computer click on start if it is highlighted service status should be running click on okay now right click on windows update select restart come to background intelligent transfer service right click and select properties for the startup type select automatic click on start click on apply click on okay now come to cryptographic services right click select properties check automatic here mine is automatic which is fine service status is running if it is not running you will see a highlighted start here okay right click on cryptographic services and restart
close services window go to start settings windows update and click on check for updates if the update is found let windows install and restart your computer the next step is reset windows update cache click on search type cmd right click on command prompt select run as administrator these are the commands to reset windows update cache run the command lines separately copy the first line paste into the command prompt press enter copy the second line paste into the command prompt and press enter in the same way run all these commands and in the end restart your computer after closing all the documents and files and folders and then check for update the next step is run sfc and dism tools if the issue still persists run sfc and dism tools click on search type cmd select run as administrator all these commands are given in the description copy the sfc command this is sfc command paste the command in the command prompt and press enter after this process is 100% completed run this command in the same way copy from here paste in the command prompt and press enter after running uh, both the commands close all the windows and uh, restart your computer if the error still occurs check if any third party antivirus is installed and uninstall it to uninstall third party antivirus click on start go to settings go to apps click on installed apps find the third party program in the list if found click on three dots icon and select uninstall on this pop up also click on uninstall if any uninstallation wizard appears follow the on screen instructions and reboot your computer if any of the methods don't works then use in place upgrade go to a browser type windows 11 download mine is showing windows 11 download so i am selecting it click on download windows 11 link scroll down and go to download windows 11 disk image iso for x64 devices click on select download and select windows 11 multi edition iso for x64 devices click on download now validation is processing after validation is completed select the product language Click on choose one drop down and select the language of your windows. Check the language selected on your computer. Click on start, settings, time and language, language and region, windows display language, country or region, United States. So select here click on choose one or, and select English United States click on confirm click on 64 bit download once downloaded click on file explorer icon go to the downloads folder by clicking on downloads 
right click on the ISO file, select mount, click on open, right click on setup.exe and click on open. Click on run. Check here. Click on next. Follow the further instructions and uh, complete the installation. That's all friends. Thanks for watching the video.